Hi everyone! It's been about 7 months since I started YouTube, and the amount of support I get from all of you is very very heartwarming, and I am lucky enough to have such a kind and patient community, especially to those who have been there with me from the very start. So today, I decided to give back to you guys. This video is not only a form of appreciation, but it is also experimental to see how it will be well received by you, and hopefully also help your shop by making some sales. And for this reason, I think $100 is a really good start. I'm going to prioritize purchasing from a lot of different shops as much as possible. I first plan to purchase from shops who have zero sales, but to be completely fair, it will be in random order instead. This will also be my first time ordering from Redbubble, so I'm pretty excited about how this one goes. If this video does well, I kind of want to make this a mini-series where I purchase different products from my audience and maybe do a design review. What do you guys think? Share your thoughts down in the comments. Okay, now for the moment you've all been waiting for, here are the 5 things you need to do if you want your stickers to be bought. First off, make sure you like this video and also be sure to subscribe to my channel. I won't be looking at shops who do not get subscribed because it wouldn't be fair to those who took the time to click the subscribe button. I also want to make this very clear because I get a lot of previous comments like, oh, I subscribed to your channel and you didn't review my shop, yada yada yada. That is because I know a way if you actually subscribed or not. For those who are not aware of this feature on YouTube, You'll know a person is subscribed to your channel if a play button appears beside the name like this. And only the content creator sees this. Now after you have successfully subscribed to my channel, you can now comment the link of your Redbubble shop. I would like to remind for those who have multiple Redbubble shops, just comment down the link of your best one. I won't be entertaining those who give more than one link, okay? Moving on with the sticker. I'm going to look at it as a consumer. So, first off, the price range must be from one to three dollars. This is because I kind of want to purchase as many stickers as I can, so that is why I decided to go with this price range. It doesn't matter if it is a sticker bundle or just a single sticker, as long as it is within my preferred price range. Lastly, in terms of designs, it has to be original. I will not be purchasing from shops who upload copyrighted works. Other than that, I have no niche preference, so you go all out in designing. If I see something that I personally like, then I will surely buy it. So any niche works for me, guys. So yeah, this is pretty much the criteria you need to follow and the deadline will be on November 20th. So be sure to follow these steps and you will be on the right track. Once again, Thank you, thank you guys so much for staying with me throughout this whole experience and can't wait to explore more. That is all for this video and I'll see you in the next one. Good luck everyone!